Waiting for YouTube con to connect. I think we're good. I think we're alive. Starting a little bit earlier. I was going to start at 11, but then I had an appointment, and then it turned out to not take very long. So then I um, spent a little bit of time grinding before the start of the stream. Still forging level 8 only, which is a little bit unfortunate. But Danny and I are working hard on winter seeds. I'm at the island right now, and I've got the wheat and melon. So I'm going to go talk to the Goreman frog and see what happens. Get some golden walnuts, and then... Probably get the island resort as the next upgrade. All right, we're showing him the big juicy melons. What was that? We just need one squid, or as much as we can get. Um, as many as you can catch. And I have Danny catching squids right now, so that we can do the targeted bait for the squid fest. We should be able to craft. We we need a. Three coral and one sea urchin for the bait maker. So we're gonna have to make sure we can craft that. Alright, Bombo Frog, we don't have garlic, so no garlic. Just gonna leave that alone for now. We'll harvest later. Alright, Island Resort, because that'll unlock the Pirate's Cove, and we'll be able to get, like, a few more Golden Walnuts from that area. So I think that's probably worth it. Let me double check that everything's working fine. Yeah, it looks like YouTube is okay. Oh, I never sent the link on my Discord. Alright, there we go. Alright, my inventory is completely full, so I need to go home. So you got a squid. Okay, that should be enough, Danny. I don't think we need more than that. Because we can catch more decked during the actual squid fest. One more in me. Okay, I have three squid. Okay. So does targeted bait just increase the chance of catching it, or...? It nearly it guarantees it. When I... Did you see my catfish stream? No. Basically, I would get cat... Using targeted bait for catfish, I got it like 9 out of 10 times catfish. Even more than that, like 9... Like 95%, I would say. For catfish, which is quite insane. Time to organize everything here. Sleep. Oh yeah, sleep time. My forage. And I'll plant some new seeds as well. Should we be turning the winter melons into um seeds? Do they get foraging XP, do you know? I I, I don't. Okay. Hello Travel's Life. Hope you're doing well. Thank you. Hope you have a nice day as well. Make sure we're getting that hardwood. Yeah, I'm gonna go get the secret woods now. If you want to, um... See our limiting factor. We don't have winter roots, we need more winter roots. And yeah, we need a larger winter chest. We can move the... Are there any mahogany trees on the island? Um, I already chopped them all down yesterday. Are we gonna make it with you getting secret woods? 
What do you mean? Uh, are we gonna make the community goal? 80? I mean, it, mine, mine counts towards it. Yeah, but I have, uh, Forester. Oh. Um, well, I'll get it for today just because I'm here and then you can get it after, I suppose. Because it's, uh, 12 versus 18. Four days. You picked that quest just so that you could be the one to get the secret woods. You told me to pick it. I know. <laughs> Hopefully those winter seeds help. I've got eight more to plant. However, I'm still forging level eight, so I feel like quite a long ways to go. Make sure you make the triple shot. Yeah, I'll do that. Too bad we can't do winter tilling patterns and just get a bunch of winter roots and turn them into seeds. That would have been nice. Pineapple can go with summer. Next seeds. Can mixed seeds be planted in winter now? Probably not, right? Yeah, they can't. But maybe because of the powder melon. Ready. What's going on? We have a pomegranate. Okay, turn that into Both jam. Are done. If you want to replant. We need to turn it into jelly, right? Yeah, this so it's like uh, not a keg. The other one, preserve jar. Uh, preserve jar. Um, mm. can you replant the star fruit in the? House. Yeah, I don't think we have enough seeds to fill the whole space. I'd, I'd rather do ancient oh. seeds, or I'll do half and half. Yeah, just plant anything. Actually, let's do fall seeds. Should I turn this ancient fruit into seeds? Um... Ancient fruit. Um, sure. I'm gonna plant fall seeds though, because I want the forge axe here. Well, we still have the island to take over. Yeah, we need iridium sprinklers, so Friday from Krobus. Friday's the uh, event though, right? Yeah, but we should still be able to access the sewer and buy a quick sprinkler. So I just need to make sure I sell some stuff for tomorrow, and then we should be good. Sell some silver pumpkins. Sell the silver starfruit. Star food in the cell chest. You can do with it as you please. Yeah, I'll sell it. Well, we can probably move the kegs and just keep them all in the keg shed together. I'm gonna make that bait maker. Okay. We are running low on coffee. Coffee beans. Okay. Well, we can just, we just need to remember to harvest them from the greenhouse and then we'll, we'll be good. All right, so we need coral, 
Three coral, one sutron. Hello, Angelina. Welcome in. Date maker. Give me your squids. Are they in the chest? Yeah, they're in the chest. Ten squid bait for you. Uh, grab the bait maker for tomorrow. Yeah, we'll want to, to keep crafting. Don't need the deluxe bait. Uh, I'm gonna make big chests. And also the triple shot. Uh, give me your coffee. It's in the fridge. The fridge? At 50 more. Triple shots as many as I can. Sixty nine. Here I have half. Don't need these chests. Are we gonna have money for a sprinkler? Um, yeah, I sold some stuff, so we should have plenty of money. Yeah, stuff for sells for a lot. Alright, Squid Fest, we rush to the- oh, and the bookseller is here. But I think we ignore the bookseller for Squid Fest. You wanna get the secret woods first, or...? Yeah, I can. <laughs> I'm off duty today, kid. You'll have to drive yourself. We can drive ourselves to the desert when Pam's off duty. That's funny. All right, let's see what's going on with Squid Fest. Oh, we've got a bunch of random NPCs here. You can hit our daily catch targets, you'll win prizes. Eight. Looks like we need to catch eight squids. What'd you say, Danny? 2,000 for a battery pack. 2,000 gold for a battery pack? Yeah, might as well buy it. Oh, and then go to the sewer for Krobus. I thought you were doing that. Well, I meant Squid Fest. 
I want to be at squid first. I can do it, it's fine. Um... Elliot's here. What, since when were squid so feisty? like eight what's the t catch target like eight squids or something i'm not sure how that like worked okay so my first not squid Did you get the sprinklers or do I? I did not. If you want to, go ahead. If not, I can do it later. I don't know if we're even going to be at Squid Fest the whole entire day. You get more for catching more than I? Uh, I'm not sure. If H the limit, then we'll see. I don't know if that meant an Iridium Squid got us 8 points or if it means catching eight gets us the highest reward i'm gonna buy a void egg too while i'm here yeah might as well okay i talked them and got some rewards hey caught any squid can you make some bait yeah, we're gonna make more bait. Okay, now do I get... Okay, yeah, now that I'm at five squids, I get two more rewards. And then I'm guessing at eight squids, I get the maximum rewards. So far, my first two catches were not squid. With squid bait? Really? Yep. That is very unlike. I mean, it's possible, but it's very unlikely. I got three squids in a row, and then I got... Right now, I've got six squids, one sea cucumber, and one sardine. Did you even give me squid bait? Give me some fake bait? It does say squid bait for you, right? Is there a multiplayer bug or something where it doesn't work? I've used four baits so far, haven't caught a squid. That doesn't seem right. This seems like a squid. Now, I don't know if it means... Oh, yeah, in the top left, you can see how many squids you've caught. Oh, I don't have any bait. His name was Friday. I got the art. Oh, crabbing. Crab pots have a 25% chance to yield double. Huh. I'm guessing I can't get any more rewards. Earned all possible rewards for today, so maybe tomorrow there's more rewards. Alright, take your squid bait. 
Well, since you caught them all, I'm gonna take it. Oops, I did not want to give that to you, Elliot, but you deserve it. Uh, did you get the Iridium Spring Fair? Yes. Okay, so I don't have to do that. Random chef. I mean, I get to keep, keep my squids. I don't know what the chef is doing. I think okay, he's going to go yeah. Are we doing this again tomorrow, I guess? Well, he said there might be new rewards. Yeah. Elliot walked through the lantern. What the heck? You wanna give me another round of eight? Yeah. I, just want I only need eight. eight. You don't need to go more. Oh, uh, correct. Eight is the maximum for all the rewards. Alright, that's eight. You got secret woods today? Yep. Alright, cool. Yo, oh, is that the famous fishing sisters? I'm going home. Yep, I took my horse. Home. Your horse. Sprinkler in the tools chest. There's more squids in the fish chest. Yeah, I'll take a trip to the island tomorrow. After Squid Fest. I don't imagine we'll need more squid bait than what we have, but I'll turn these final two squids into bait. I put eight in the chest as well. Also, I have some winter seeds to plant. Can you get a watering can? Yep. Uh, 
Um, do we have space in our coop? Should I sell someone to get a void chicken? Uh, can you see what happens if you incubate it? It, it took it. Okay, then it should be fine. Alright, we can water it. We can just let the sprinklers water them. It's fine. Wait, where'd you put them? Um, uh, they're on, like, the left side, but just let the water sprinklers water it. It's probably fine. Got it. It's hard to tell which ones. How many did you plant? Like, ten. Not a whole lot. Uh, okay, they all look watered. We could use more iron. An iridium squid, fancy. You want to plant my winter seeds? How many do you have? Done. Yeah, I can plant them. Let's plant them in the spots that have already been watered. Sleep time. How much squid bait do you have now? Uh, like at least 30 or 40. So I should have enough okay. for both of us. Yeah, I'm only at like 15, but that's enough with yours. Got it. Welcome back, Tim. Today we're doing a little multiplayer discovering the update and we're going to squid fest today welcome back hope you're doing well smoked squid smoked squid probably sells for quite a bit do you have the artisan sell bonus no i'm a rancher you want to switch your profession to that i should i think you probably should because we'll um We'll also get starfruit wine going at some point. Actually, I'm going to start brewing some starfruit wine. Doing well oh, as for, well. Uh, wait for chicken to hatch. At least. Well, it should be a set amount of days, so I would yeah. get it tonight. Like, when, I think it's once you put it in. Going to secret. Okay. I brew the coffee into triple shots. I will eat spicy eel triple shot to move a little faster. And then, yeah, we've got enough squid bait, for sure. I'm gonna make another trap bobber just to help out with them a little bit. Can you give me one? Yeah, I'll make two. Alright, Squid Fest day two, here we come. Oh, today we have to catch ten squids for the rewards. Oh, fancy. This would be very difficult without squid bait, but squid bait makes this not too challenging. Uh, 
I would not a squid. I don't care about treasure chests today. Multiplayer time passes, so I need to... Not a squid. Exit out. You got the trap hopper? Yeah, let me catch this one first. Here's some squid bait and trap bobber. Thank you. Um, it's like a mini festival, kind of like the Trout Derby is. The NPCs don't really attend it. It's kind, of, it's kind of like the night market where you can just kind of go as you please instead of like... It doesn't freeze time or anything. So it's interesting. Wow, this squid is a feisty one. <laughs> Catfish with the squirt gun. Potato sleepy. Yeah, I'm sleepy too. I've been sleepy for a while. Yesterday's stream I was awake though, but I streamed for quite a while. Monday's stream was the worst though. Monday um, during the day I was fine, but then Monday night I was so sleepy I couldn't stop yawning. squids almost halfway there See if we can get a perfect catch on one of them a train well at least this is less RNG based than the trout derby is those gold tags. You're at work, Angelina. What else is new? You're always working. But very good. Hope work is going well for you. I don't know if this would be possible without squid bait. Definitely not in multiplayer, I think. Oh yeah, single player maybe because time freezes, but multiplayer squid bait is needed for sure. I wanted to go to the island today, and I think I'll have just enough time to... Problem is, I've got all these rewards. I got Trap Bobber, 15 Winter Seeds, Dish of the Sea, Treasure Chest, 3 Triple Shots, 
Squid hat? It's your chance to wear a squid on the head. Okay. Squid hat. Nice. I do like my dark cowboy hat, though. I'll go to Ginger Island tomorrow. Is today is anybody's birthday that I may have missed. Tomorrow's Harvey's birthday. Save some coffee. Um, I think we have two coffees in a chest. Welcome in, Trish. Welcome in. Hope you're doing well. Glad you're here. Tim, not gonna chat off. I'm gonna leave this on the background doing school stuff. Well, hopefully school stuff goes well. Yeah, don't worry yourself out too much. Good luck with the school stuff. I mean... This chest is filling up. Come give me your winter seeds. Yeah. Craft even more winter seeds. We're filling up most of the farm fields with our winter seeds here, and still I'm only foraging level 8. Takes so long to level up foraging. Glad you're doing well, Trish. Right now, I'm in a multiplayer world with Danny here. And we're at winter. Um, we're currently trying to grind out foraging level 10, because that's going to be the skill that's the hardest. For, um, combat level 9 right now, but combat level 10 is pretty easy. It's just grinding out skull cavern dives, probably, or whatever is the fastest way to do that, but... Forging level 10 is always a hassle. Okay, I've got them all planted. I get my inventory organized though. Put the food item away in here. Clay goes in here. And then my squid hat, I'll put in my dresser. Won't wear the squid hat today. Final day. Um, I'm gonna go to the island and try to get that done. Ooh, pomegranate jelly. We can go take this to the raccoons. Forge is done. Don't tell Danny. Now I want to see if this will actually get me to level 9 or not, because I know Forge Seeds have been nerfed, which is kind of silly, I think, because Foraging was always such a grind to begin with. Why does it seem like Winter Roots are so rare? 
compared to the others. I don't know, we had the most of it, uh... To begin with, yeah. Returned it all, all in. Okay, um... 240. Actually, Snow Yams was the limiting factor this time. We have 240 winter seeds to plant. Traveling cart doesn't have anything. I think we're gonna be one sure of port after I do Secret Woods. Well, hopefully, um, mahogany trees at Ginger Island have grown back. I'm not sure. But maybe one has grown back. What are we missing now? Crocuses? Crocuses. I'll put some more in the chest. Now we're missing crystal fruit. We have some in the chest. Oh, we got it. Okay, that's good. With the last stump. Okay, winter root. Just remember to turn it in. We ran out of snow yams, that's fine. Danny, I have 374 winter seeds that we need to plant. Okay. I'm gonna turn it in Robin's quest. All right, go for it. And then we should be able to get one um, this harvest and then one more harvest after this harvest. And that still hasn't put me at foraging level 9. There's uh, one more snow yam in the chest for you. Okay. Anybody in chat happen to know... the exact amount that the forge seeds have been nerfed to, like the XP that they give? That would be nice to know. And if this is actually worth it or not. Okay, but this new little hopping thing is quite interesting. Kind of weird, kind of finicky, but it's cool. an upgrade watering can, right? Can you help me with watering? Yeah. Using the charge is probably faster because animation canceling is slower with steel water and can. Oh, but you notice how you can hop around while you're charging up? Huh. It's kind of nice. Although sometimes it doesn't line up how I want it to. Okay, I have no idea if I have hoed too much space or not enough, but let's start planting. 
I don't want to give you my seeds. like almost the perfect amount. Alright, um, I'll go, um, to Ginger Island. We, you have, uh, yeah, we have enough for Rob Newton's project. Um, I still might go to Ginger Island still. Oh, I've got all these quests that I have been ignoring. Lions' blackberry basket, I can do that one, that's an easy one. Oh, the raccoons need the jelly. I'm gonna go do that. Don't know anything about XP points, but they're free and not costing anything to plant except a bit of time. That's true, yeah. Worst case scenario, we're getting a good amount of money out of them, but I'm sure that they still give a bit of XP. I think it was nerfed, but at least they still give a bit of foraging XP. Alright, have some pomegranate jelly. <laughs> the raccoon bundles are funny. Thanks, Bobo. Take this. Raccoon journal? Can you get the raccoon journal? It costs 999. <laughs> What did Library. I what did I learn? So that's for multiplayer then. Weeds have a greater chance to yield mixed seeds. I guess if you want one then Should have the fiber. And fiber, yeah. I'd help me water. Watering can. You're done watering pretty much. You missed two spots. Alright, sleep, I guess. Um, coffee in the greenhouse first. Have we gotten one of each fruit tree sapling? Fruit tree fruit. Um, besides Ginger Island ones, I think. Oh, we forgot Harvey's. Okay. Forgot Harvey's birthday. That's okay. Oh, it's the night market already. Wow. What do we need to do at the night market? Just catch one of each fish at the submarine? seeds you think this new farm is really good or just okay it's not like good it's fun like early game it's kind of nice to have the free chickens free eggs 
But late game, um, the space is kind of bad. Like, we don't have a lot of room for planting. It's all kind of cramped to one corner of the farm. But, I mean, the bluegrass is cool, and, like, the animal mechanic, I suppose, is cool. Like, I guess it harvests, um... Bluegrass speeds up the friendship with the animals, is what I'm assuming. So I'd say it's like cool in concept, but I probably won't be choosing this farm again. For multiplayer, I always like the Four Corners farm. Okay, we need to go to the island and plant some fall seeds um did you get the stumps today no i'm gonna get them Hopefully I get forging level 9. Standard map, the best map. In terms of min-maxing and if you want as much space as possible, then yes, it's the best map. But if you're just playing like casually and for fun, then um, whichever one you want to choose is fine. If you want like the best all around, like the four corners farm is nice because it gives you a mini quarry and then also like it gives you some stumps. For speedruns, the forest farm is the best. The forest farm is usually the best because of all the forgeables you get from it. Um, so it really depends. But usually in terms of making money, profit, I feel like the standard farm is the best one. But it all comes down to your situation and personal preference as well. Danny's over there waiting for Leia to come out, give her the goat cheese. Speaking of that, I should be giving Abigail pumpkins. Abigail does look good with her... without her bow. It's interesting. So used to her with her bow. Usually his favorite farms, the four corners, even single player, and I'll try to do meadow once out for switch. Yeah, meadow farms is interesting for sure. Prismatic jelly for monster musk for sure. How long do we have for that? A week? Yeah, we get a week for that. Hello, Willy. Are you gonna wanna do that or should I? Um, you can start on that. I'm going to the island right now to plant some stuff. Should I close down the resort? Um, I mean, we're not like... we need for it is the recipe. I suppose leave it open for now. Four Corners Farm is a pretty decent farm for sure. I don't have my thing on me. I don't have my hammer on me or scythe. Why don't you keep anything on you? Hey, for inventory management purposes. Well, I always forget them. It means I can't harvest the wheat because I don't have a scythe. better for the slime job because you have a 
larger monitor. I suppose, yeah. I mean, we'll probably have to end up both working on it because it is rare. Well, we have a whole week. I'll do it tomorrow. Um, after I'm done at the island today, I'm going to go to the night market and fish. Hopefully mahogany trees give a fair amount of XP. Wish you could send me coffee through the void, you sound tired. I'm a little bit tired, yeah. But what's new? I feel like I'm tired fairly often. I've got coffee in-game. I think the goal of this stream is forging level 10, although that's... Quite a ways away. I'm still forging level 8. Sometimes I feel like I'm not getting forging XP. And that's broken. Apparently that like oh, the... Found you found it? Okay, cool. Apparently the carrots, summer squash, broccoli, and powder melons are called raccoon I seeds two, in the yeah. code. I got two. Yeah, I got two ectoplasms. But they're going to disappear. Hmm. Maybe I need to drink some water. That might help a little bit. Alright, Night Market is now open. Are we buying all Lupini paintings? Uh, if you want to. I bought an original Lupini. Gotta get the truck. I can buy a single winter seed. Do we need any spring seeds? While we're here? Probably not. Garlic? Do they have? No, no garlic. Do I have the secret note for the mermaid? I don't, need, I don't think you need it. What's the order? Do you know the order? Uh, relatively. It's like one, five, four, two, three, something. Now we gotta sit through the mermaid show. I don't even want a pearl. I don't even want the pearl. I'm just gonna go to the submarine and catch the three fish I need and then be done with the night market. Is this Caroline? Oh no, this is Emily. Emily looks interesting. I will take a free cup of coffee though. I'll uh, turn in the prismatic on the 17th. Turn in the prismatic? Oh, to the wizard? Yeah. Yeah, because that's his birthday. That makes sense. Do you need Scarecrow for perfection? You need to craft a Deluxe Scarecrow, and the Deluxe Scarecrow recipe is gotten from all Scarecrows. So technically, yes. Once you collect all eight Rare Crows, you get sent the recipe in the mail, and you have to craft everything for perfection. So you do kind of need it. Um, the submarine is currently in use. Can you not get down? No. <laughs> it's in use. Well, that's dumb. I thought... I thought that it was individual. Well... 
Do I have to go back up then? If I want to fish. Should I take us back up? Fine. It's going to make me pay again though, probably. It's what, 500? A thousand. That's fine. Let me in. We're coming back up. We're coming back up. Yeah, you pay this time. I don't know why it has to take so long to get down to the bottom. Uh, there we go. Once we catch all three, we'll be done. I don't want to stay here for too long. I have a spook fish. Never gotten that far too much watching and not enough playing. Hey, you're, I mean, watching is definitely preferred by some people, so there's nothing wrong with that. Wait, yeah, I've done perfection a couple times. I think like two or three times. It's definitely a big feat, takes a while. I got a sea jelly, but... Not hooking any fish here. Oh, I saw my squid bait on. Do you have bait that I can borrow? That's a lot of deluxe bait. Is that only half of your bait? Yeah. Wow. I've been, uh, I have one in my house. Been collecting uh. it every day. We're gonna have to do this again. Should we just pass out? Yeah, we can just pass out here, it's fine. Oh, here's a octopus. It's just a midnight squid, blobfish, and spookfish, right? Right. Alright, I got all mine. I've got a freaking octopus here. I only have the spook fish out of my three. Okay, this one could be a midnight squid, but I think it's another spook fish. Okay, it's a midnight squid. Now I need blobfish. Come on. Come on, give me the blobfish. Not the seaweed. Give me the blobfish. Yeah, this one's a blobfish. That's some good luck right there. Okay, I'm done. I can do one more. I got some seaweed. Let me out. Yeah, how is Linus gonna save us from here? Yeah, we're stuck at the middle of the ocean. Comes in a scuba tank. It was the wizard who sometimes saved us. Let's see who saved us. It was Joja. The star dropped a... Linus saved me. He came for me and left you behind. Left me easy for Joja. Fish chest is already full. I'm gonna move the bait and stuff over to the crab pot chest.
Artifacts go in here. Uh, do we wait around for the night market again today, or do we just skip? I don't really uh, care about the peony. I'm gonna get the secret woods at least. I'm gonna get Lydia. I need to remember to grab my hammer and pickaxe. I don't even have my pickaxe on me. Um, big chests are unlocked from Robin's shop for 5,000 gold, and I believe they're accessible from the start of the game. That's what it seemed like. Is this world going to be 100%? Uh, most likely, sh yeah. I mean, perfection is not too hard to achieve. Right now, I just want to figure out what's behind that that door for opening, um, getting level 10 and all the skills. I know it has something to do with, like, skill mastery or something. But still, I haven't spoiled it too much, so I'd like to see that soon before I get anything else spoiled too much. But the problem is, I'm still forging level 8, and I've been grinding out forging XP for such a long time. Is there anything else new with winter, or no? I think so, I don't know. Do we just skip through? For foraging uh, seeds? Uh, we have to... Sleep time? The wizard tomorrow. Yeah, wizard tomorrow, but besides that... Now you come into bed. Hold up, I'm with Leo right now. Well, you could give her a gift tomorrow. You can only give two gifts per week. I'll give Abigail a pumpkin tomorrow. We're close with her. I'm closest with Elliot. Hmm. Well, Leia's birthday's coming up, so... Mm -hmm. Yeah, I should get eight with her from that. Yeah, I know that the foraging seeds give less. What's a bell gave birth to a baby pig? Huh. Yeah, I know that it's nerfed. The forage seeds are nerfed, but they still give you a little bit at least. So that's why we're growing forage seeds. Because they still give us a little bit at the very least. Wait, this is my field. Your field. These cows are not producing. Alright, our void chicken hatched. Did you want to buy an auto grabber? Yeah, I can do that. And I'm gonna go change my profession. Make sure you grab a wizard birthday gift. Um, purple mushroom. Yeah, we have enough. Bean hot pot, is that from Demetrius? Beach foraging helped you a lot. Just open the door on your farm. No spoilers for me. <laughs> Sounds good. Um, yeah, beach foraging. I guess every Saturday we check the beach. I'll check there now. I've been getting good a little bit. Here's closed on Wednesdays. That means I can't give Abigail a gift. How rude. 
Ага. I suppose ginger island foraging would work the same. Secret Woods. Stumps give a fair amount of XP at the very least. I don't know why Concerned Ape would nerf the forage seeds, because it was a grind to get those anyway. Yeah, foraging was always the last one I've, I, I would get. Have a birthday gift. Alright, auto grabber, and we've got a void egg hatching, so we can do the magic ink quest soon. The holly? Oh, I should have gotten the holly. I'll get it tomorrow, because it should stay there. Because the holly gives XP, that's right. Supply shop. Auto grabber. Forgeables, like, build up, so the ones that the uh, holly that are there, they should stay there tomorrow. Alright, you want to sleep? I am doing a couple things in town. And then I will. Plop the auto grabber down. Preserves jar. I'll put some star fruit for the preserves Catch jar. Or red mullet. Huh? It's a quest. Yeah, I'm. I think we've gotten everything unique from the prizes, so I'm gonna just ignore those now. Cool. Cool hat. Yeah. I think the book was the main thing. By the way, the book, the friendship book, is 10% boost. Friendship 101. It's decent. I wonder what books we're missing. I remember there was a diamond one from the volcano. Oh, the dwarf. Uh, go, come to the mines. Is it just money? I believe so. Yeah, Dwarvish Safety Manual. Bombs deal 25% less damage. Which is nice for a multiplayer for sure. Okay, 
They are in desperate need of iron soon. Gold ore. I'd rather keep gold ore for crafting mega bombs. I craft a second iridium band. How many more solar essence? Never mind. All right. Sleep time. Sleep time for meals, so, because I'm tired. Well, we're going to keep going for a little bit more. Hey, I got Artisan. Artisan. Do we want to grow ancient fruit in spring? Like on the field, should we start um, grinding out um, seeds? We should. Or do we want to do spring we can do that mainly, But we should also grow a bit of all the other crops as well, just to have some on hand for cooking and whatnot. Do we do spring seeds mainly? For the Forge XP, Spring Forgeable Seeds in Spring. The, the, yeah, that's fine. I'm just saying we should do at least, like, maybe 20 of all yeah. the other crops. Just to have some on hand. Yeah, that's fine. Alright, I will go to Secret Woods today and get the Holly. my spice seal or else I would eat the spice seal but rather save that for school cavern oh finally foraging level nine nice it's been forever Upgrade my trash can. It's gonna be a while until forging level 10. That's 5,000 more XP I need. And I need to share it among Danny as well. A lot of forging XP. Hopefully these are done soon. Well, I'll just leave those ones there for now. Let them all line up together. Uh, anything else today or sleep? Uh, I am at the island. Island. I guess I need to plant some more fall seeds in the greenhouse. Were their forge seeds ready, or are they still growing? Uh, they are ready. Um, I'll bring over some seeds to plant. 
Yeah, I'll just come over and do that. I wish we had the island obelisk. It's probably the first one we want to save up for once we start getting like a lot of money. It's a million gold, but it's worth it. I can start farming for dragon teeth. Well, the dragon teeth isn't the hard part. The money is the... I mean, I suppose both are hard. Dragon teeth, we need 10 of them. But it's mainly that money. Can you bring five flute blocks? Uh, is it raining? No. Then I'll do it later, because I'm already on the way. Also, we should do pirates tonight. Is today an even day? Yeah. Okay. Oh, I didn't bring my scythe. Of course I didn't. Tomorrow is sprinkler day. Fine, that's not something we really need to worry about for a very long time. Uh, should I buy the mailbox so we can get to the pillar? Um, we have the dig site, we have the. Should we do the island trader? It could be the parrot express too. Parrot Express isn't the most useful thing in my opinion, especially in multiplayer, it doesn't save as much time. Yeah, we can do the mailbox. Okay, I'm gonna start on some dragon teeth. What is this, 10 or 20? Yeah, we need 20 for the warp power. There's still plenty in the volcano, I think. We haven't been there a lot. Do we get them all from the muscle rocks? Probably not either. I got a few. I wasn't counting though. I think it's five that we can get. Yes. Alright, maybe I'll come to the volcano as well, grind some combat XP. <sighs> Leave the forgeables here. Well, I guess I am eating that spice seal after all. Oh, I should have brought 10 diamonds because of that book that we can get. Bring 20. Well, it's too late. But yes, next time. that these guys give good XP, so I'm gonna just slay everybody that I come across. Make sure you kill the lava lurkers.
Pirates go of time soon. Only one of us has to do it. I can do it, that's fine. How much X so we need five thousand XP. How much XP do enemies give? Welcome back, Angelina. Welcome back. We're just kinda chilling, trying to grind up my forging XP. Well both of our forging XPs. I recently hit level nine. Why is Gus in the bottom right? Open your skill screen. At the bottom right, I have Gus with the present. Does that mean Gus is my secret Santa? I have Leo. Is that... Means who we are most attracted to. <laughs> I think that means Leah is your secret Santa. Like, yeah, you, you give her a gift, which is actually works out really well for you. Um, yeah, I guess, because we'll... Oh, but we we have to make it rain. No, 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 never mind. Because they'll just get me to 10. I'll get to 8 with her birthday. It'll rain in spring. I just mean I didn't want to be capped with the... Eight, where's eight? Here it is. Eleven. I just gave one. I get a walnut. Okay, I got two teeth. I'm gonna leave. today. How am I this bad at darts today? <laughs> okay, there's the triple 20. Now we need a bullseye. 30. And 11. Okay. Not too bad. Alright, last game went in 10 throws. This one I have to focus for. Okay, we got the three walnuts from there, and then I believe there is a walnut to dig up that Danny already got. I'll most likely pass out, or I can go to bed at the island here. Save a thousand gold. I believe passing out at the island you lose a little more.
Did you make it back home home or are you at the island? I'm at the island. Okay. What else do we have to do other than, like, grind up foraging XP? Like, I feel like we should just be skipping days and just focus hard on forage XP. Uh, there's combat. I'm farming for teeth. Yeah. But combat... Combat will be fine. Combat will be quick. I know there's that new desert festival that we might want to check out. I don't know if we'll get to it this stream or if it'll have to be next stream. And so far into spring it is. I think it's like third week. Uh, probably not then. Depends. That might be something that Rob might want to try. We'll try to coordinate with him. Look at this, Holly. It's a Wednesday, so Rob's probably working. But yeah, coordinating with others and all doing the Desert Festival together might be fun. the cinder shards on you? They're in the ginger island chest. Oh, okay. must have been harvested yesterday um i guess i can go to school cavern today i don't know what else to do or give abigail a gift abigail's probably home right did you get a sprinkler oh sprinkler today as well yeah i can do that Winter outfits make me want, like, seasonal outfits for each season. I'm sure there's a map for that. Alright, Iridium Sprinkler. Um, let's just go to sleep. I'm in the mines. Well... 
Or the volcano. I don't want this stream to be just continued grinding. I guess I can go to Skull Cavern for a little bit. There's a mod for that, Angelina. Yeah, there's a mod for everything, isn't there? I suppose I can forage and chop trees in the desert. Now serpents give 20 XP, so 5,000 divided by 20 means we have to slay 250 serpents, which I think also gets us the napalm ring if we slay like 100 or 150, something like that. So might as well grind out serpents. And mummies. We'll have to do mummies eventually. Don't have any bombs on me, or my explosive ammo, of course, so that's a little unfortunate. I don't know how I'm supposed to do Skull Cavern without bombs. Oh, if I talk to the wizard, I complete a quest. Um, yeah, I don't have any bombs on me, so no way I'm doing Skull Cavern. But I went there for the bomb, or for the slaying the ghosts, for sure. I don't even need the prize tickets. I just want to get the forging level 10 and check out the new door. Winter sucks. Friday is wondering where you've been. Oh, well, starfruit wine's done. <gasps> it's yellow now. The the wine is the color of the thing. That you put in. That's so cool. Starfruit wine's actually yellow colored. That is interesting. Uh, do you have artisan now? Okay, I'll save that for you. And I'll go talk to the wizard. He's grinding out the volcano right now. I need to find something to do. Guess I can bring the sprinkler over. Um, forge. Winter forge seed should be done tomorrow, and then that should get us a bunch of XP. Hopefully.
All right, my pumpkins are for Abigail. My healing item, we can use summer squashes, I suppose. Are you about ready for bed, Danny? Okay. What's luck today? Is it super luck day? I'm gonna do a skull cavern dive today then. Oh no, it's a winter forge day. I can't do a skull cavern dive today. Winter forge is ready. Hopefully this gets us closer. I know these are nerfed, but at the very least they should still be giving us some forge XP. Look at all these. I am curious to know if anybody knows what the exact amount of XP I get from these are. I mean, hopefully it's worth it. Hopefully what I'm doing is still worth it and like getting us forging XP. There's so many. I wish there was a meter to see how close we were. You get three XP from them now? Thank you, A. Um, so that means... 5,000 divided by 3 is about 1,662. That's not terrible. That's a lot. 3 XP is not a lot, though. But it helps. Or at least, it's at least helping. And at least the ground stays tilled and watered so we can replant them easily. Done with the harvesting, and then I gotta do the planting. Okay, so crocus, crystal fruit, winter roots. Wiki said it's only two, only two XP, so we need 2,500. At least it adds up. 
But we need so many. Because... Oh, but it's using the gold star ones first. That's no fair. The seeds are wild seeds, which I think that forge seeds, it's 2 XP unless it's in a garden pot, which is 0. It's 2, yeah, 2, 3 would have been fine, but 2, what it was before, I have no idea what it was before, but it was way better. How much do we, how much XP do we get from chopping a hardwood stump at the secret woods? Because that's the next best thing. Is that like, what, 10, 8? Twenty-five. Okay, so twenty-five per stump means twenty-five times six stumps. Twenty-five times six is hundred fifty. Five thousand divided by hundred fifty means thirty-three days, thirty-three secret wood days to get from forge level nine to ten, which is kind of ridiculous. I know, I don't understand. Uh, Danny, we can buy hay, I suppose. If needed. I don't know why Concerned Ape decided to nerf the foraging seeds by that much. Rabbit foot. What's the rabbit foot for? I could give Gus an orange at my thing. Oh, for the, the van, for the car, yeah. Yep, I suppose that is a good idea to do. Twelve XP per tree. Yeah, farming trees, I guess, is the other best thing. Five thousand divided by twelve means four hundred sixteen trees, which is a lot, but it's doable. One combined with like chopping stumps. Oh, uh, Danny, sell the starfruit wine and jelly. Have fun with your game, Angelina. Have fun. Um, I can take the shortcut. Town, quarry, town. Thank you, Aperske. Thank you for the luck on the grind. Thanks for stopping in the stream. I must not have the secret note for it. Do you have the secret note? Hmm. 
Weird. Maybe I don't have the secret note for it. Okay, well, I harvested approximately 500 forage seeds. So 500 times two is a thousand. So I'm like two out of five of the way there. I'm at like 40% of the way to foraging level 10, I would say. Two times 500, yeah. 1,000 XP, about 1,000 XP. Oh no, that's one-fifth of the way there. We need 5,000 XP. I was thinking it was like 2,500 for some reason. It's only like 20% of the way there from that whole harvest. So yeah, chopping stumps is definitely the way to go. But we'll focus on getting through winter and then probably wrap up. I don't want to go for too long today. But I do want to get through winter. Maybe like a little bit of spring, we'll see. I'm curious to see if there is a New Year festival, because I thought Concerned Ape was going to add a New Year festival. Danny, I'm just going to chop the stumps and then go to bed. I'll probably repeat that a few times. I can't believe the four sheets used to be seven. They used to be so good. Yeah, go ahead, bye, hey, that's fine. How much do wild forge give? Seven? Oh, for the forge grind, going to bed in this bed is probably best. Because then I can just have a little bit quicker start. Wonder, waiting for Marnie. Oh yeah, we have to wait for Marnie. Let me check the calendar real quick and see whose birthday it is. Leia's is next on the 23rd. Probably missed somebody, didn't we? Oh, we missed Evelyn yesterday. Oh well, I don't care about Evelyn. I don't really care about running the NPCs, but try to get some other birthdays. We do have... Hold on. Grass in winter. I thought grass all died in winter, but grass... There, we have grass. We can just cite the grass for hay. Wow. I don't know why I didn't think about that. It could be, Danny. I don't know. Could be exclusive to this farm, but maybe, maybe not. I don't know.
All right, bedtime. probably going to be able to marry Leia before we end the stream. Sleep right away today? I don't think there's anything else essential today, right? And then tomorrow's your big day. By the way, chat, Danny has not been talking. Danny is just typing in chat right now. Just wanted to make that clear because maybe chat thinks I accidentally muted him or something from the stream. It's definitely a possibility, but no, that's not the case. Uh, yeah, I'll take a goat cheese for Leia. I'll meet you by her cabin. I think I can go inside. That luau definitely helped. Check the forest for forage. Jack be nimble, Jack be thick. I got that book and I've gained one defense. Interesting. Missing six? Missing six what? Hearts? Or books? Oh. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, I'm missing six, I believe, as well. Probably the same ones. I know we can get one from trading ten diamonds to the dwarf at the volcano. Might need to call it early in real life, but it'll probably wrap up the stream after, um, after then the winter, the new year, see if there's anything new with the new year, new year festival. All 
All right, we know Danny's rushing off to date Leia now. I'm just ignoring those quests at this point. Where's Abigail? I want to give Abigail a gift. Give it to Sam. Feast of the Winter Star is the 25th, I believe, so we'll attend to that. Bookseller. Doubt there's anything new with the bookseller. Oh, we can take a look. Should do a tier list on NPCs winter outfits, how good they are. I think that'd be fun. Fun random thing to try. Seven forging XP is seven forging XP, so I will grab any forgeables I find now. There's a forging book, I'm buying it. Baden Bobber. Why is it always Baden Bobber? Horse the book? I guess I'll buy Horse the book. sleep for a feast. Oh, 
Oh uh, yeah, I bought the horse book if you're at the book fair and want to do that as well, go ahead. Otherwise, I would just wait and yeah, you're there, okay. Did you sell the starfruit wine yet? Yeah, you sold the starfruit wine. I hope these mushroom logs give foraging XP. Alright, bedtime. Yeah, I'm gonna leave the mushrooms in there, why not? Don't smelt any more gold ore, I'd rather turn into mega bombs. Save it for mega bombs at least. That time. It doesn't sell for a whole lot. Wow. Hey, it's Santa. What is the base sell value of squid? Because that's sold for like nothing. Oh, it's only 80. Wow. Considering it's hard to catch, I thought it would be way more. Okay, um... Wait around for the peach launch star. <laughs> you wonder how Kiro's doing on the bracelet? Yeah, I wonder as well. <laughs> Gift for Gus. Let me check the greenhouse. We should have oranges. Full. This is why I don't keep all this junk on me, all these tools. Okay, greenhouse is taken care of. I'm gonna sell the ancient fruit because we need money. I 
Yeah, hey, aren't you going to the feast? All right, Gus, where are you? Got something from George. New shop? Oh, nothing good. Okay, no books. Jade, not too shabby, George. Jade, um, or George knows I like my jade for my staircases on Staircase Sunday from the Desert Trader. Yeah, nothing too good here. Price the powder melon costs two and a half thousand gold. Like, that's kind of goofy. A frozen tear for two and a half thousand. Plan for five hundred. Pierre's trying to rip us off. They're all in their nice little winter outfits. Alright, it's just gonna be wake up, grab the stumps, and then go to sleep until the new year, and then I'm hoping that there's a new year festival. Sometimes I feel like the Dance of the Moonlight Jellies is kind of considered like new year for Stardew. Or right, this has the same kind of vibe. You haven't reached forging level 10 yet, have you? It is quite a grind. I feel like I'm at least halfway there. Uh, I'm gonna buy the rare crow. Just because it's only available fall and winter.
All right, sleep. There's not anything on the calendar, so I don't think there's going to be a New Year festival, but just in case. I'll worry about the starfruit wine later. good for the race on Friday, right? Cool. Alright, sleep and last day. That's a lot of money from 18 starfruit wine. That's why in my min max I'm growing starfruit and turning it into starfruit wine because it makes so much money. I'm gonna check out the beach and see if there's anything like new going on there. After I get the secret uh, wood stumps. So I thought in one of Concerned Ape's tweets he posted like some sort of like New Year's festival at the beach. But maybe I'm wrong. Danny, do you know what I'm talking about? I don't know if you've seen Concerned Ape's tweets. Nope, okay, maybe I'm going crazy. Parrot seeds. You marry Leia yet? Oh wait, you can't because it's not raining. That'll have to be a next time thing. Mm, nothing going on at the beach here. I guess we'll go to sleep and see if there's like a cutscene overnight. Maybe New Year's Day Festival. I'm 
Let me try to look it up real quick, actually. Stardew New Year Festival. Yeah, there's a tweet that looks like there's a New Year festival. Do we have to go to sleep for it, or do we have to wait around? I feel like it would have been on the calendar if there was something. Sleep? Alright, well let's try sleeping for it. See what happens. Well, I don't want to wait around till 12, so let's sleep and see what happens. Seems like there's a cutscene. No, no cutscene. Oh, well, there's the Desert Festival on our calendar now. Kent jump scare. Oh yeah, Kent jump scare. We can skip Kent cutscene now. Okay, I'm gonna wrap up the stream now. It was a short stream, but again, I'd prefer to wait until more people are available to jump on and do the Desert Festival, and I think these first two weeks of spring are gonna be pretty much the same. We're just gonna grind them out off stream most likely, and then return for the Desert Festival next time I do this series. So thank you everybody for stopping in today. I know this was a short one, but thanks for who everybody who stopped in. Hope you have a good rest of your day. Say bye to Danny. He says bye to chat.